hi guys you're highly welcome to my channel if you are just tuning in for the first time you're welcome god bless you my name is mercy and you're highly welcome i want to say thank you for stopping by to watch my video i really do appreciate you thank you and god bless you <laughs> please consider to subscribe to my channel okay and highlight so that you get notification from the youtube whenever i upload a new video all right to my return subscribers thank you for always coming back to watch my video all right for your comments your prayers your like i really do appreciate and i am praying for you and i want you to know that my angels are out there to work for you okay <laughs> yes today i'm so happy and i want to share this revelation with you okay it's all about simple solutions to challenges of life. But sometimes, some people, they will tell you, I've tried this, I've tried this. It's not working, brother. When you have tried one thing and it didn't work, before you go the second time, why do you not ask for mercy? Just ask for the mercy of God, okay, to go ahead of you. So that the second time, we give you testimony. So that your problem will not look as if it's too difficult, okay? For God to handle, nothing is impossible with God. With God, all things are possible, and I strongly believe that your case will be settled after you have watched this video and try to give it a try to help your life, and it shall be so in Jesus' name. Once again, you are welcome to Solution Center. Okay. <laughs> Hmm, today I want to talk about how you can boost your attraction between you and your spouse. Okay. You know, Sister Messi is very interested in happy homes, a, 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 a marriage full of love and peace. Okay. It's, I'm very, I'm very, very much interested. I'm really interested to see that your house is full of joy peace and progress by the special grace of God. So when we talk about battle, we talk about prosperity, we talk about love. Because mm, love is a beautiful thing. Alright guys, today video, just watch and see what I'm going to show you. Now, if you find out that you and your spouse, despite you are living together in one house, but you are living a separate life. You are together in one house. Maybe he always comes to see you whenever at night he feels like he wants to prove himself to be a man. He wants to come closer to you. Apart from that, no affection, no romance, no closeness, and all that. No intimacy, yes. You find out that your spouse is having an affair with somebody else outside and if you prefer that person than you you find out that the family issues i mean the parents or her parents have succeeded in dividing your home or friends have succeeded in planting and sowing good um, bad seed into your spouse heart okay and you know they are giving him or her advices that is really affecting your marriage. You want both of you to come together as God has commanded you. You don't want anybody to separate you. You don't want anything to come in between both of you. You are going to do this, okay? Now, this one is generally for a lot of questions. My husband is not staying with me. What do I do? My husband is not staying with me. Now, you can do this. Your husband is staying with you. Your husband is not staying with you. You can do this because the recipe you're going to use is what you see. This one is not where you say, in my country, we don't have this. This is what I'm going to show you. In your country, you have everything. You have it in your country. You have it in your fridge and in your kitchen. Okay, that is what we are be showing. For how do we use it together? You know, to get our desired result. That is what I am going to show with you today. You know that the three things which are faith, hope, love. 
the greatest among all is love okay if you are in a relationship and you you the, the, the love is dry there is no love there is no affection is not really good because gradually gradually separation is coming before you know divorce and all that all right and you find out your spouse like i said the mommy's pet and daddy's pet my mommy say my daddy say you want him to always listen to you you want him to love you you want him to come back to you okay you want to bring his heart his attention his affection back to you in a natural way with prayer packing it up with the word of god that god has given unto you where you are about to go into that marriage or god has instituted the marriage has given his word and his promise and you want to him to come back to you. you don't want to go diabolic way you don't want to go and look for one thing to put in his food for him to eat and love you you know love charm and love boy and at the end it will become problem i will be showing you how you are going to naturally bring his attention back to you he will come back to you he will love you he will stay with you he will take care of you both of you will live together in one in one heart in one spirit in one soul because the bible said you are together you are no more separated all right and it will be so in jesus name now this one uh is not really only for couples okay you can also do that you actually want somebody to love you actually want somebody to okay maybe you're having issues with your brother your sister you want the aim to come back to you you want to win your daddy's love back your mommy's love back. you can do this but you have to base it on the scriptures okay now i can drop that scripture now I can only drop the scripture for the those that are married. Okay, so you can also do that. Let's get down into the video. For this particular recipe, we'll be needing an orange. You know that a fruit is very, very important when it comes for success in anything you're doing. Fruit is very, very much important. All right, we'll be needing an orange. Next thing we'll be needing is your penaipo. That is what we'll be needing. We'll be needing penaipo. Here is my penaipo. Very sweet one. Very, very sweet penaipo. Now, it's not compulsory that you are going to use all orange. You can use banana. You can use a bunch of penaipo. But you are going to use this method that I'm going to show you to do this so that you can get effective results okay first you'll be needing a pen and a paper all right we're going to need a pen and a paper for instance you're going to need a pen and a paper You are going to write you and your spouse together. Let me say, for example, Sister Mercy and Sister and Brother John. I will now write them together for forever. Mercy and John. Okay. I don't know, you can see it eh? together forever. Then I will put scripture, Colossians, all right? Three verse 18 to 19, okay? Matthew 19 verse 6, okay? Finally, efficient, efficient for verse 2 to 3. Now I've done writing, I'm going to circle it. One, in the name of God the Father, I'm going to circle it. Two, in the name of God the Son.
in the name of God, the Holy Ghost. See, I've circled it. Now, if I'm doing it to myself, for example, if I want to do this prayer, back it up for somebody, I will fold it to them. But if I'm doing it, you are going to fold it closer to yourself, all right? You are going to bring it because it's what you are bringing to yourself. You are going to bring it to yourself. You see, you bring it to yourself. Now you are going to get your orange. This is orange. From the middle, we are going to remove it from the middle. All right. So, is it that orange or up, um, orange or banana? Uh, or what's it called? Pineapple. Okay. You see, I need something that has water. Okay, so I see. I've succeeded in making a hole. All right, I'm going to put this, which I fold, in the middle of this orange. All right, Let's see. Let's see, I've put it then. My pineapple. Look at my pineapple. I'm going to squeeze the juice. Because pineapple is very good when it comes to restoring love. Restoring love between you and your spouse. Pineapple is very, very good. All right. I'm going to squeeze the juice. Is what I need. Then I will start my prayer. I will tell God, Father, let them be sweetness between me, between Sister Mercy and Brother John. Let them be sweetness. Let no man come together again. You see, the paper has been soaked. Now, what I'm going to add again into this. All right. What I'm going to add now is my sugar. If you have grounded sugar, it is fine. Me, I don't have grounded sugar yet, so I'm using Q. I'm going to try and skew it in, inside it, all right? All right, so I'm going to try and put my sugar. So if you have grounded sugar, I think that one is better, okay? All right, wonderful. Highly attraction. Highly powerful. Last that I'm going to add is my honey. I'm going to put honey, there will be honey. Your marriage, Sister Mercy and Brother John, will be sweet as this honey is sweet. Your marriage will be sweet. Ah, Jesus. See the audio. So thick. Okay. Your marriage will be sweet. It will be full of honey. It will be full of sugar. Nobody can separate you. No man can separate you. No woman can separate you. In the name of Jesus. I am attracted to you if you are the woman you are doing it for your husband. As orange is in the bush and it will attract the buyer to come and buy, so shall I attract you. Morning and night I will be attracting you, um, you my husband. You measure your spouse's name. Or you, if you are the man doing it for your wife, morning and night, I will be attracting you. I will attract you my love, the love of my life. I will attract you. No woman else can attract you. No man will attract you. Nobody can separate us. In the name of Jesus, no power can separate us. Once you have done putting these things together, you are going to hold it close to your mouth and make your declaration. According to... Colossians chapter 3, verse 19. The Bible said, Command, if you are the wife, the Bible commanded you, John, to love me, me, your wife, forever, to get her forever. No retreat, no surrender. No power can come in between us. No power can stop this marriage. No power can stop our joy. In the name of Jesus, I command you to begin to love me. I attract you in the dream. Physically, in your office, I attract you. I will always be in your 
in your heart. Our this orange is sweet. Our love, our marriage will be sweet. And from now we start experiencing sweetness. It will be full of sugar. It will be full of favor. It will be full of prosperity. Okay. It will be full of honey. Honey is sweet. It will be full of sweet. When you see me, I'm sweet. I'll be sweet till Jesus come. You will love me till Jesus come. You will love her till Jesus come. Okay. You will love me till Jesus come. I remain one and the only love of your life in this life. And so must it be. The zeal of the Lord will bring it to pass. In the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I call my guardian angel to bear witness. I call God Almighty. I call His Son, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit to bear witness today that I've sealed up my love between me and my husband, John. And no power can separate us according to the word of God. When you are not doing this, my brother, my sister, now if it's your brother, your, you want your, the attention of your daddy, you want the attention of your, your sister back, okay, you can use a, 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 a First Corinthians chapter 13, First Corinthians 13, 13, you can use that one and that to pray for love. God has commanded us to love, and the Bible says, love your neighbor as yourself, okay? I command you to begin to love me as I love you. I bring back your heart, your attention, your feelings back. Begin to think about me as your son. For example, you are the son that your father has rejected you. Okay, you begin to tell your daddy, Mr. Joseph, begin to think about me and your son. Let that your semen that are for me begin to connect me back to you. You are a daughter, your mother has this one. You tell your, uh, your mother, you Elizabeth, begin to think about me. As your daughter, let the umbilical cord that have connected me and you bring us back again. Yes, that is one of the things that you cannot separate a mother from the a, a child because of that umbilical cord okay let it bring us together let the womb that carried me begin to call your attention but you will pray this prayer thank you holy spirit you will pray and pray and pray on your manner the manner of your prayer it depends on what you want to attract and keep together forever now this thing that you have done is together forever when you are done doing this please close it up all right Close it up with any other thing. Look at it. I've closed it up with the pen I don't want to open it. You close it up with pen I Then look for a white nylon. Okay? Don't use black. Use a white nylon. Look at it. I'm going to tie it very well. Alright? Dig a ground and bury it. Do not turn it. Don't let the honey pour. Do not turn it upside down. Stand it like this. Dig a ground and put it and cover it with sand. Bury it with sand. If you don't have white nylon, bury it like that. There is no problem. Why I say white nylon? Because I don't want sand to enter inside it. But no wahala. The sand can also stand as a weakness. So dig a ground. You dig a ground, a hole. And put this orange together put this orange and you bury it all right we're going to do this recipe for three days first day for the god of father to bear witness second third and fourth okay when you are done doing this if there is sun outside okay come out and, and lift it up before the sun and make your declaration it must be done at any time you want to do it midnight if there is moon, lift it up and make your declaration. You want to do it in the morning, God bless you. Go to your morning dew and make your declaration. You want to do it afternoon, as I'm showing you right now, go. There is no specific time to do, but you must do it three days in order to get maximum results. And when you are done doing three days, just give God thanks because it is a settled case. I hope nobody will come and tell me I don't have sugar, I don't have honey, I don't have pineapple. I don't have orange, but I don't have banana. Banana, you open banana. You put it in between the banana. But orange is better because orange is deep. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye.